Hello and welcome back super mums. In this video we're going to be looking at what exercise should you be doing? Which one is actually best? So a lot of personal trainers will tell you that their thing is the really the best option, it's going to get you the best results. Not me. I'm going to be completely honest with you. It's time to bust open this myth once and for all. please make sure you are liking, sharing and subscribing so we can reach out to more mums and help them enjoy their motherhood. If you're not a health and fitness professional like me, the idea of doing any kind of exercise can be incredibly daunting. Add to that the fact that you are bombarded both on and offline by what the latest amazing thing is that you've got to do hit this month. Oh, now it's all about the spin. Everyone could just run. Oh, we should all be weightlifting. Let's all start Zumba. We are constantly being thrown these new ideas of what the best fitness and best exercise is. The fact of the matter is, unless you've got a very specific goal that is kind of more elite level, like running a marathon or doing some sort of bodybuilding competition, the best exercise is the one that you're going to do consistently. Yep, it's as simple as that. If you're looking at health and fitness as a whole, exercise wise, it's just about doing it consistently. If you find something that you are going to show up for for your twice a week session and consistently do without feeling like, oh, this is hideous, no, I don't want to do this, that is the exercise that is best. Consistency is key, something that you can thread into your life. Now, for some people, that might be running. The idea of just throwing on your shoes and your gym kit, running out the door and running back in when you've finished is amazing. I love running. Correction, I love the results of running. I love once I'm on the run, but I struggle to leave the house. So realistically, come the winter, I'm gonna be on the cross trainer at the gym as opposed to going out and running, even though I know that if I got out, it would be quite good. You might work better with a personal trainer knocking on your door and getting you up at 5 a.m. and using your garage as a workout space. You might wanna meet up with the girls every week and go to salsa class. Like, it does not need to be what everyone else says is the cool in or fatty thing to be doing at the moment. I'm gonna say it again because it's so important. Consistency is key. Find the one thing that you find energizes to get you out the door and go consistently. Now don't worry, I am realistic. I love weightlifting, but there are still some days when I'm like, oh, I don't wanna go. And I have to dig deep to find my motivation. But don't worry, there are gonna be some videos in this series on physical health that really look at the importance of motivation when it comes to exercise. So make sure you check the link down below for this month's playlist. If you're really struggling for inspiration, I've even created a four week home kit free workout that you can download for free. Uh, it's just linked down in the description. I would love to hear about your fitness goals down in the comments below so I can try and help you in more ways. I am actually a qualified health and fitness professional and this is an area I've worked in for some time, dealing with people with some extreme weight issues, but generally focusing in on health and fitness for a happy life. I look forward to connecting with you on this amazing journey through motherhood and remember that being a super mum is all about being the mum that you want to be. Remember, don't forget to hit subscribe and turn on your notifications to never miss out on a video again.